Now look at part two. For each question, choose the correct answer. You will hear a boy telling a friend about a presentation he has to give at his college. How does he feel about it? So, ready for your presentation tomorrow? Yeah, I think so. I don't know why I decided to do it on modern art, though. I mean, I've got far too much to say in ten minutes. It took ages to prepare, and when I tried doing it at home in front of a mirror, it took much longer. But that was useful. It means I've been able to leave out some bits. Right. Are you showing a video? Yeah, but only a short one. So if the computer doesn't work, it won't matter too much. Good thinking. Now listen again. So, ready for your presentation tomorrow? Yeah, I think so. I don't know why I decided to do it on modern art, though. I mean, I've got far too much to say in ten minutes. It took ages to prepare, and when I tried doing it at home in front of a mirror, it took much longer. But that was useful. It means I've been able to leave out some bits. Right. Are you showing a video? Yeah, but only a short one. So if the computer doesn't work, it won't matter too much. Good thinking. Nine. You will hear two colleagues talking about their offices. What do they agree about? So, I heard they're going to paint the offices in different colours. Yeah, I know. I think it's a great idea. Those white walls are so boring. And actually, I read that certain colours can change your mood, help you concentrate, be more productive, more creative. Then why have lots of different ones? I mean, sure, maybe green walls keep you calm, but who wants to sit in an orange office? I wouldn't mind, actually. But you're right. Maybe they should find out what the best colour is for concentrating and feeling calm and stick to that. That wouldn't be a bad idea. Now listen again. So, I heard they're going to paint the offices in different colours. Yeah, I know. I think it's a great idea. Those white walls are so boring. And actually, I read that certain colours can change your mood, help you concentrate, be more productive, more creative. Then why have lots of different ones? I mean, sure, maybe green walls keep you calm, but who wants to sit in an orange office? I wouldn't mind, actually. But you're right. Maybe they should find out what the best colour is for concentrating and feeling calm and stick to that. That wouldn't be a bad idea. 10. You will hear two friends talking about a TV quiz show. How does the woman feel about it? Did you watch that new quiz show on TV last night? That music quiz? Yeah, pop quiz. I thought it was really interesting. I could actually answer some of the questions for once. I know, me too. Where do they find the people who appear on it, though? It was incredible how little some of them seemed to know about music. And the presenters' jokes really weren't funny. Oh, I like the fact that it's fun. And the prizes are silly, too. I think that's what I didn't like about it, really. Now listen again. Did you watch that new quiz show on TV last night? That music quiz? Yeah, pop quiz. I thought it was really interesting. I could actually answer some of the questions for once. I know, me too. Where do they find the people who appear on it, though? It was incredible how little some of them seemed to know about music. And the presenters' jokes really weren't funny. Oh, I like the fact that it's fun. 
And the prizes are silly, too. I think that's what I didn't like about it, really. 11. You will hear two friends talking about a drama club they go to. What do they like best about it? The drama club's changed a bit since all those new people joined, hasn't it? Well, yes, but you can learn a lot from them. They have some really interesting conversations about things you wouldn't normally think about. I find that all a bit dull, to be honest. I'd rather get on with the drama. I'm getting much better at speaking loudly and clearly without shouting. Oh, I know what you mean. And I'm much more confident with my singing as a result of the club sessions. That's what we go for, after all. Now listen again. The drama club's changed a bit since all those new people joined, hasn't it? Well, yes, but you can learn a lot from them. They have some really interesting conversations about things you wouldn't normally think about. I find that all a bit dull, to be honest. I'd rather get on with the drama. I'm getting much better at speaking loudly and clearly without shouting. Oh, I know what you mean. And I'm much more confident with my singing as a result of the club sessions. That's what we go for, after all. 12. You will hear a woman telling a friend about a musical she went to. What did she think of it? So, how was that musical you saw last night? It was OK. I'm not keen on that type of singing and dancing, really. But I could see the actors knew what they were doing. And the orchestra wasn't bad at all. The trouble with musicals is that you can never believe in them. What happens to the characters just isn't true to life. But it was a musical comedy. Isn't that the point? To escape from everyday stuff and have a laugh? Oh, there were plenty of laughs, but I always knew exactly what was coming next. Now listen again. So, how was that musical you saw last night? It was OK. I'm not keen on that type of singing and dancing, really. But I could see the actors knew what they were doing. And the orchestra wasn't bad at all. The trouble with musicals is that you can never believe in them. What happens to the characters just isn't true to life. But it was a musical comedy. Isn't that the point? To escape from everyday stuff and have a laugh? Oh, there were plenty of laughs, but I always knew exactly what was coming next. 13. You will hear a man telling a friend about a department store. What impressed him about it? Have you been to that new department store on West Street? Yeah. It's basically the same shops you get anywhere, but they're much bigger. So they've got some different stuff. It's worth going for that. Right. A friend told me things are a lot cheaper there too. Well, I guess it depends on what you buy, but I haven't noticed that. One thing people complain about is that there aren't enough shop assistants that you have to queue up to pay. Well, I expect that depends when you go. True. Now listen again. Have you been to that new department store on West Street? Yeah. It's basically the same shops you get anywhere, but they're much bigger. So they've got some different stuff. It's worth going for that. Right. A friend told me things are a lot cheaper there, too. Well, I guess it depends on what you buy, but I haven't noticed that. One thing people complain about is that there aren't enough shop assistants that you have to queue up to pay. Well, I expect that depends when you go. True. That is the end of part two.